It's interesting. I woke up this morning. Realizing that Mark Jacobs truly had made me. And I was thinking about. Oh my gosh, here's this robot that is following me everywhere. Indy, exactly. by the double. Yo, right by the double. Right by the double RL store, yo. Oh my gosh, people said Mark Jacobs was gonna be the next Ralph Lauren. Well, you know what? He was the next Mark Jacobs, still is. You know, grateful, not hateful. I was just thinking the other day, you know, about the current state of hashtag interventions. I was like, I have no idea because I dipped back into my Twitter account. Excuse me. Uh, I actually got this really big water bottle recently to put in a water bottle sling because I thought, great, I'll just carry it and I won't need to ever purchase water. I think I can just drink from my sling. <laughs> but now I'm like, I never want to carry it. Do you know what I mean? So I'm like, because it just feels like it's going to be too much. I should just test drive it tomorrow. Will I post this tonight? Yeah, I'm going to make a comment to post this tonight. I'm going to test drive this maybe tomorrow when I go to work. My other work. I don't know. I just keep thinking about that grunge collection that Mark Jacobs did for Perry Ellis and well, it was in 1992, but it was for spring, summer, 1993. And that's what I wanted to say, actually. And when Arthur and I got together, one of the things that I really loved about him and still do, and I think about him in my memory, is he just always said what he thought, you know? And sometimes he had an attitude, but his attitude was so sexy to me. You know, because because he was younger and he knew a lot of shit. You know, I sometimes joke that he was my best student. Oh my gosh, this is what I'm saying, right? There's a license plate right here. I can't really film it, but it says Art C One, and in front of this four eight eight. And Moscot is across the way where I used to purchase my glasses from when I lived back in New York, right down the block from Moscot in the Lower East Side. But Arthur, who works in fashion as well, would say to me his finger was on the pulse. And I was like, well, actually, if your finger's on the pulse, you're behind because you actually need to be ahead.
you know. I think it's the same difference, actually. I just realized I was supposed to make a left at a certain point, but... There's no button to pass here. Uh-oh. Oh, I'll just go this way. Um, yeah, I will just go this way. One of the things that I've been working on... One of the things I've been working on One of the things I've been working on is um trying to be more free. Table. In order to plan my trip today, so I was a little bit. Late. But I thought it's the journey, not the destination, Sean. It's the journey, not the destination. There's an apartment building that looks just like this in Glendale. Hey, Panda, my friends. Oh, I see. What happened here? He just got a little turned away, turned around. Anyway, I'm just stunned because I went to tell tales at a school. The beloved booker of the improv just left the club wearing 
black, white, and gray top. Seventh Avenue across the way, see it? Eh. Maybe you can't. The strip of Fairfax isn't particularly cinematic and I've lost the light. Anyway, although this, this estas pintoras, Ugh, the light. We hope Pride officially starts on May 31st, my father's 80th birthday. It's also been 31, 32. years since the grunge collection for every Ellis. While well, my grunge collection was Gettysburg College. actually a story I have not told. Let me just tell you the story. Where am I walking to Hollywood Boulevard, I guess? I need the exercise people, you know? I don't believe in the concept of fat. Just like I don't believe in the concept of gender, just like I don't believe in the concept of any of these things, even as I embody them strategically, because that's how I understand myself in the world, and I take comfort in that, and there's a lot of other ways that I experiment with the way that I inhabit the world, right? I mean... The point I want to make is speaking about 
Bjork at, oh, it's 15 minutes. Anyway. Done. That story is going to have to come for another time. This was very interesting. We'll see if I post it. Shiva. Yoga. Oh, no. That's what I'm going to do. See, people? Bonus footage. I'm going to get the four... Actually, now that I should do, I should go into the Whole Foods and get a drink. Anyway, I read a really great set before I came out here tonight. It's a Ferragamo Forense in blue. Remember, people. Oops. Remember, people, I love Juliette Binoche in blue. Blau! I am debating whether or not I should go to this Whole Foods to wet my whistle. Water, people! Wait. They wouldn't let us drink from water at Gettysburg College that fall. I was like, great, they want me and my students to be dehydrated. I said, no. I think... Right, signs. Defining the gray area between black and white as off white. Now, you know, this is funny. I go through this all the time. Oh my gosh, people. Oh my gosh, people. I don't know where this, I don't know where the bus stop is. Is it up here? Parlay, parlay. Too close to that door. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I just is exactly what Mark does. Shows his life to the world. Well, I'm showing my life. Where's the subway? I mean, the bus. Look at this job. Mm -hmm. I don't know, maybe I'll... Chop and screw this video. Show for now.